Poetry Projects by William Nolf. The Poet's Mind by Alfred Lord Tennyson. Alfred Lord Tennyson lived from 1809 to 1892. He was Poet Laureate of the United Kingdom during much of Queen Victoria's reign, and remains one of the most popular poets in the English language. His most famous poem is Charge of the Light Brigade. The Poet's Mind Part 1 Vex not thou the poet's mind with thy shallow wit, vex not thou the poet's mind, for thou canst not fathom it. Flowing like a crystal river, bright as light, and clear as wind. Part 2 Dark browed sophist, come not anya, all the places holy ground, hollow smile and frozen sneer come not here. Holy water will I pour into every spicy flower, of the laurel shrubs that hedge it around. The flowers will faint at your cruel cheer. In your eye there is death, there is frost in your breath which will blight the plants. Where you stand you cannot hear from the groves within the wild bird's din. In the heart of the garden the merry bird chants. It would fall to the ground if you came in. In the middle leaps a fountain like sheet lightning, ever brightening, with the low melodious thunder, all day and all night it is ever drawn from the brain of the purple mountain which stands in the distance yonder. It springs on a level of bowery lawn, and the mountain draws it from heaven above, and it sings a song of undying love, and yet, Though its voice be so clear and full, you never would hear it, your ears are so dull. So keep where you are, you are foul with sin, it would shrink to the earth if you came in. As always your comments and ratings are much appreciated.